Aisha. Hi, mommy. So, what are we going to learn today? We're going to learn some math facts. Amazing. If you're watching this video for the first time, last week we had done a video on mental maths where we had done addition and subtraction of multi digits all in the mind without any paper and pen. So, today, on the request of all the subscribers and some of my followers on Facebook, today we are going to give you a step by step guide on how to master mental maths. Number one, which goes without saying, whether maths or mental maths, we need to master our basics. So go to my channel and there is a playlist named Kids Math Series. So go through the videos all about numbers, where we have covered all the basics, greater than, less than, then the videos on addition and subtraction, where we explain the concepts of addition and subtraction. We have done various ways to do addition and subtraction and various addition and subtraction properties which will help in understanding the concept better. Uh, number two, then uh, we had done a video on number bonds. Number bonds is another way to do addition and subtraction but it requires a little bit of memorization. We did various ways to make five till the number 10. Uh, eventually, if you want to move on to do addition subtraction of larger numbers, the number bonds from five to 10 should be thoroughly memorized. Then uh, today we are going to be doing a video on some of the math facts. If you know them, you can do maths with lightning speed. Then next week, uh, we're going to do a video on fact families, wherein we'll show you how to derive four addition subtraction sentences from one number bond. Why this, we'll do this because sometimes, you know, addition is easy, but subtraction is a little bit difficult. So if you know those equations, how to do them, subtraction will become super easy. So stay tuned for the video next week. Then we'll show you how to do addition subtraction of numbers under 20. If you have followed us till here, that will be very easy. You can do those addition uh, subtraction in your mind. Then after that, we'll do a video on place value. Why is place value important? If you want to do addition subtraction of numbers 100 and beyond, the concept of place value is very important, whether you want to do math mentally or paper pen. So stay tuned for these videos. And the last video in the series would be, we'll do a quick recap of the mental maths video providing all the solutions of how we did those addition subtractions. So today, let's do some maths facts. So let's get started. The first math fact that you should be very thorough with is number bonds. What is number bonds? It's various ways to make a third number, two combinations of numbers that make up a third. We have thoroughly covered what are number bonds, various ways to make numbers from 5 to 10 in the video called number bonds. I would suggest go through that video first. If you know your number bonds well, some of your math you can do with lightning speed and moving on to addition subtraction of larger numbers, you can do that very fast. So let's move on. Let's learn some more addition subtraction facts. Ishan, what is number plus zero? Number. Number minus zero? Number. Number minus number? Zero. Number plus one? Next number. Number minus one? Previous number. Number minus previous number? One. Let's do this in more details. Now let's do the zero property. Ishan, you said that number plus zero is number, right? Yeah. Let's do this with the help of an example. So we have four multi-link cubes, okay? Okay. I give you zero. How many do we have? Four. Exactly. You gave me nothing. So we still have four. Great job. Now let's do this. Number minus zero is number. There are four math link cubes. I take away zero. How much do we have? Four. Exactly. We still have the same because I took away nothing. Yeah, you took away nothing. Now let's do number minus number is equal to zero. So we have six math link cubes, okay? I take away all the six math link cubes. How many do you have? Zero. Exactly. I took away everything. You took away everything. Yeah. Now let's do plus one and minus one rule. So Ishan, you have four math link cubes, okay? Okay. 
I give you one more. How many do you have? Five. That's the next number, right? Yeah, that's four plus one equals five. So that means number plus one, you always get the next number. Now let's do number minus one. You have five math link cubes, okay? okay? I take away one. How much do you have? Four. That's the previous number, right? Yeah. So if you take away one, you get the previous number. And that's five minus one equals four. Now number minus previous number is equal to one. So let's do this with the help of an example. We have uh, six math link cubes, okay? okay? If I take away five, which is the previous number, how much is left? One. We can also understand this with the help of number bonds. Let's understand this one. Number minus previous number is equal to one always with the help of the concept number bonds that we had done in our earlier video. So let's say, Sean, 10 is made up of 9 and 1. So if I take away 9, how much is left? 1. Exactly. So 9 was the previous number, right? Yes. So answer is 1. Let's yes. do with the help of one more example. And we know the number bond is 10. 9 is made up of 8 and 1. Right? Yes. So if I take away 8, how much is left? 1. Exactly. So see, 1 is left again. Now let's do this. With the help of one more example, 8 is made up of, made up of 7 and 7 and 1. So if I take away 7, how much is left? 1. So you always see if number minus previous number is always 1. Ishan, what is 100 minus 99? 1. Exactly. Great job. Now we are going to be doing doubles facts and it's easiest thing to learn in math. Actually, if you think about it, it's skip counting of two or even numbers which we will cover later. So let's get started. Ishan, what is one plus one? Two. What is two plus two? Four. What is three plus three? Six. What is four plus four? Eight. What is five plus five? Ten. What is 6 plus 6? 12. What is 7 plus 7? 14. What is 8 plus 8? 16. What is 9 plus 9? 18. And what is 10 plus 10? 20. Great job. The next math fact to know thoroughly is the number bond of 10. I know we have covered the number bond of 10 and other numbers thoroughly in the video called number bond. But let's uh, do a quick and a fun way of the number bond of 10. Let's get started. Ishan, can you tell me various ways to make 10? 10 plus 0 equals 10. 9 plus 1 equals 10. 8 plus 2 equals 10. 7 plus 3 equals 10. 6 plus 4 equals 10. And 5 plus 5 equals 10. Great job! Now we we'll learn the last math fact of the day. We'll see what happens when we add a number to 10. That's the easiest thing you will learn. We have already covered this concept in our first video all about numbers where we were learning the numbers from 1 to 100. I would suggest going through that video you know, and learn how we did that. But let's do a quick recap of that concept in a fun way. Ishan, what happens when we add 0 to 10? It's just 10. Exactly. What happens when we add 1 to 10? 11. So that is 10 plus 1, right? Yes. What is this? 12. 10 plus 2. What is this? 10 plus 3 equals 13. Right. 10 plus 4 equals 14. 10 plus 5 equals 15. 10 plus 6 equals 16. 10 plus 7 equals 17. 10 plus 8 equals 18. 10 plus 9 equals 19. And 10 plus 10 equals 20. Great job. 5 plus 5 equals 10. 
Click the red button subscribe to get more videos from us. If you do like this video, do not forget to like this video, comment and share. In the meanwhile, stay tuned for our next set of videos in this series. Thank you and goodbye.